Welcome, space enthusiasts and energy dreamers. Today, we're diving into a cosmic concept that's out of this world, literally. What if we could harness the sun's energy with a Dyson sphere? Buckle up, because we're about to embark on a journey that's part science, part fiction, and all mind-blowing. First off, let's talk about what a Dyson sphere actually is. Imagine a giant structure that completely surrounds our sun, capturing almost all of its energy output. It's like putting a lampshade around the sun, except this lampshade is billions of miles wide and generates enough power to make your electricity bill look like pocket change. The concept was first proposed by physicist Freeman Dyson back in 1960. Dyson wasn't suggesting we build a solid shell around the sun. That would be crazy talk. Instead, he envisioned a swarm of satellites or structures orbiting the sun, each collecting a portion of its energy. It's like turning our entire solar system into one massive solar farm. Talk about going green. Now you might be thinking, why would we need that much energy? Well, imagine a future where we've colonized the solar system. We'd need power for everything from terraforming Mars to running intergalactic TikTok servers. A Dyson Sphere could provide energy on a scale that makes our current power plants look like AA batteries. But here's the kicker. Building a Dyson Sphere would be no walk in the park. In fact, it would be more like a walk across the entire Milky Way in flip-flops. The amount of material needed would be staggering. We're talking about dismantling entire planets to get enough resources. Sorry, Mercury, but you might need to take one for the team. Let's crunch some numbers, shall we? The surface area of a sphere that could encompass the sun's orbit would be about 2.2 times 10 to the power of 23 square meters. That's a lot of solar panels, folks. If we used all the planets in our solar system, sorry, Pluto, you're still not invited, we'd only have about 0.1% of the mass needed. Talk about a supply chain nightmare. But let's say we somehow managed to gather all the materials. We'd still need to figure out how to construct this cosmic megastructure. Current estimates suggest it would take hundreds, if not thousands, of years to complete. So if you're planning to invest in Dyson Sphere stocks, you might want to consider a very, very long-term strategy. Now you might be wondering, what would happen to Earth if we built this thing? Well, for starters, we'd be living in perpetual shadow. Imagine a world where Throw some shade isn't just a saying, it's a way of life. We'd need to say goodbye to sunbathing, solar eclipses, and those pesky UV rays. On the bright side, pun intended, we'd save a fortune on sunscreen. But wait, there's more! A Dyson Sphere would completely alter our planet's climate. Without direct sunlight, our atmosphere would cool dramatically. We're talking about a new ice age, folks. So while we'd have unlimited energy, we'd also need to use a good chunk of it just to keep ourselves warm. It's like cranking up the AC in summer and then needing a sweater, but on a planetary scale. Let's not forget about gravity. The sun's gravitational pull keeps our solar system in check. Start messing with that and who knows what could happen. We could end up playing cosmic pinball with the planets. Oh, look, there goes Mars again. Now, some of you might be thinking, this all sounds great, but what about the aliens? Good point. If we could build a Dyson Sphere, surely other advanced civilizations could too, right? In fact, astronomers have been searching for signs of Dyson Spheres around other stars. It's part of the search for extraterrestrial intelligence. So far, no luck. Either aliens aren't big on mega-engineering projects, or they're really good at hiding their cosmic construction sites. But let's get back to the benefits. With a Dyson Sphere, energy scarcity would be a thing of the past. We could power everything from interplanetary travel to massive computational systems. Want to simulate an entire universe? No problem. Need to teleport to Alpha Centauri for a quick vacation? Easy peasy. The possibilities are as endless as the sphere itself. Of course, with great power comes great responsibility. We'd need to figure out how to distribute all this energy fairly. Otherwise, we might end up with some serious cosmic class warfare. Imagine the slogans, Occupy Dyson Sphere, or the 1% controls 99% of the sun. Now, I know what you're thinking. This all sounds great, but is it really feasible? Well, with our current technology not even close, we're still trying to figure out how to make solar panels more efficient here on Earth. Building a structure that spans the entire solar system is a bit out of our league right now. But that doesn't mean we can't dream big. In fact, some scientists are already working on smaller scale versions of the concept. There's talk of building solar satellites that could beam energy back to Earth. It's like a baby step towards a Dyson Sphere. We've got to crawl before we can run. 
or in this case, before we can envelop an entire star. So what have we learned? Building a Dyson Sphere would be an incredible feat of engineering, requiring resources and technology far beyond our current capabilities. It would revolutionize our energy production, potentially allowing us to become a true spacefaring civilization. But it would also come with enormous challenges and potentially catastrophic consequences for our home planet. In the end, the concept of a Dyson Sphere serves as both an inspiring vision of our potential future and a humbling reminder of our current limitations. It pushes us to think big to imagine what might be possible if we continue to advance our technology and expand our understanding of the universe. Who knows, maybe in a few thousand years, our descendants will look back on this video and chuckle at how quaint our ideas were. They might be sipping their quantum lattes in their Dyson Sphere apartments, wondering how we ever managed with just one planet's worth of energy. Until then, we'll keep dreaming, innovating, and reaching for the stars. Or in this case, reaching around them. So the next time you look up at the sun, remember, that's not just a giant ball of burning gas. It's a potential cosmic power plant, just waiting for us to figure out how to tap into it. And who knows, maybe one day we'll be able to turn that burning ball of gas into the universe's biggest disco ball. Now that would be a party for the ages. So what do you think? Is a Dyson Sphere in our future? Or should we stick to more down-to-earth energy solutions? Let us know in the comments below. And remember, keep looking up. The future is bright, even if we might end up putting a lampshade on it.